Rachel here with Sense of Tempo County Corso. Oh, yeah, you better clean it up. It's because Cashmere, it's because Cashmere went after her, scared her a little bit. And she did, yeah. She's just showing her his boss. See, so she. In her, in her eyes, they're getting too amped up. Oh, God, look at her. Now she's trying to nurse. Look at her trying to appease Cashmere by trying to nurse. Woman. Is that bear cub? Big old bear cub. Big old bear cub. Let's see. Let's get a look of him. Good night. Oh, you're a heavy man. Seven weeks old, y'all. Big old bear cub. Let me see. Hold on. Oh, they're in there fighting. Look at that face. Hold on, Savannah. Hold still so I can get his face. Just hold still. Bear cub. Hey, cutie, yeah. Look at the big old face. Look at the big old bear cub face. <laughs> Look at those paws, man. Cute. Let me see these paws. Jeez Louise. Good night. Who did you big old paws? Who did you have big old paws like that, huh? Yeah, you did, huh? Mm -hmm. That's so sweet. Aww. Are you jealous? I see you being jealous. I see you. I see you being jealous. Yeah, poor chinchilla. He's gone. I mean, not poor chinchilla. He's gonna. Yeah, poor for us though. Let's go say hi to the puppies, shall we? There you go. Go play, chinchilla. That's not chinchilla. Not chinchilla. That's Sorry, baby, bear. baby bear. Or bear cubs, whatever. Bear, bear. Oh, what's up? Y'all in here fighting? That's uh, Napoleon. What are you fighting about? Yeah, Napoleon's in here too. He's the only uh only brindle. Hey, cutie. He's your bear cub. Who did your bear cub? Hello. 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 Yes, hello. Hello. Need you, cutie. And here's hello. Oh gosh! And there's the guy we're keeping. Hey there! I haven't named him yet. Hey, bear cub! Oh, my baby bear cub. So <laughs> this is a baby bear cub. Look at a face. In your face too. You got it. No, don't bite me. Don't bite me. Don't bite me for being jealous. Don't you bite me? Oh, you got a cold, wet nose. A cold, wet nose. Who doesn't love a cold, wet nose? Oh, look at you. You're so sweet. Oh, no, no, we got a fight over here. Who's that? Is that Bear Cub trying to beat him up? Her. Her? Okay. Yeah, Bear Cub is tough, man. He's a, he's not just big, he's dominant too. Luckily, though, he's going to somebody that's very knowledgeable about dogs. He's a, 
Um, I want to say he's a police officer that works in the canine unit, or did work in the canine unit. I think he's fixing to retire, so yeah. Um, he's going to somebody that is going to be really good at being able to handle anything that he's got to offer, which is cool. Because the truth is, you know, there are no bad dogs. There's just, you know, um, either bad owners or mismatched, um, you know, dogs with owners. And so it's always important to know what your limitations are when picking out a puppy and listen to the breeders when they tell you that they think that a different puppy would be better suited for you. And, um, and then what you can do is in the meantime, you need to practice and you need to get better so that the next time you go buy a puppy, the breeder feels that you can handle any puppy, you know? Yeah. Like when I go looking for a dog, I don't have to worry about anything. The only thing I have to worry about is structure. I don't have to worry about, you know, how dominant the dog is because I know that I can handle a dominant dog. In fact, I prefer them. Um, so I, I much prefer a dog that is tough that once they learn that, that they're not going to get away with it, then they just stop versus a, a, you know, a soft dog that you have to hold its hand through everything and they're traumatized by everything and they're just very weak minded. You know, I don't want that. I want a tough, hard dog. So that's how uh, Preacher is. That's how Cashmere is. You'll see it in all my dogs. They're, they're tough, you know, but I like that. Is he peeing and playing at the same time? Oh my God. He has redefined bathroom shenanigans. Seriously. Wow. Wow, Bear Cub. Wow. Really? Just trend setting over here? Yeah, he's like, it's not just for potty, you know? It's also for play. Oh gosh. Jeez. Who is that over there? Is that the little girl? I don't think so. I think the little girl is right there. Yeah, she's right there. I don't know. Where is she? Okay. All right. I'm so surprised she's not up here screaming at the top of her lungs. Thank God. She is so, you guys, you don't even know. She is so, so, so loud. Not all dogs are like that, but every now and then, in every litter, we have one or two screamers. And um, Velocity, quit it. So, she started, look over here trying to assert her dominance. Like, that's a puppy. She don't even know any better, man. Mm -mm. She don't, oh, oh, she don't got no common sense. Oh, look who's... We got a mosh pit over here. Ooh, ooh, not putting up with it. Not putting up with it. Not putting... He's like, you better settle down. Male. Yeah, a little trouble. So, oh, my gosh. Did you see that? That little puppy just flew through the air. It's crazy. You know, what's funny is that most people's puppies are like clumsy and falling all over the place, barely able to walk. Ours are like running around, trotting around, looking good, jumping around all tall. Like, uh, it's crazy, man. It's, it's amazing to see what the working dog structure does for a dog, even at a young age. You just, you see it right off. It's the same way that like <laughs> the, the herbivores in the wild have to be up and running very early, very quick. Um, and like, and our, our livestock usually are not like that. You know, they need a lot of recovery time. So we want to breed strength, not weakness. Mm -hmm. Well, they all have beautiful faces, just different kinds, you know, mm, look at that. Look at that structure on him. Is that baby bear right there? Chewing on the fence right there? No, we're here at the baby bear right here. Yeah, that's what I said. Oh, yeah, 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 that's what I'm saying. Yeah, good, yeah, out. very good structure on him. He's actually oh, wow. supposed to be uh, going to a home where he's going to be shown as well. So I'm really excited about that. Yo, quit chewing on the gate, sir. We, you know, we want our dogs to be shown so that they can help and, oh, like I said, jumping around, so that they can help to make sure that we're uh, that the lines are healthy, that we're breeding healthy, capable dogs with good structure, like their dad. Look how good Napoleon is just sitting here chilling. He's such a good boy. He really is a sweetheart. <laughs> yeah. Anyway. Well, we got somebody to come uh, pick up another puppy today. Two of them, two more are going today. So I got to get to it. And um, we'll talk at you later. Bye.